friends so our question now is we have to do in order traversal of binary tree so in order traversal of binary tree okay so given a binary tree so we have to do its in order traversal so now you are happy that okay i know this because i know how to do in order traversal using recursion and that's what i studied in my first few lectures in data structures but a next constraint comes that is you have to use iterative method and here is the problem so i was taught recursion and recursion was also a big thing it means you have to learn and understand just three lines of code and it is traversing the whole tree but now they are asking iterative method so let's see how to do so we have so how to do in order traversal using iterative method so let's first recap the in order traversal using recursion so we write void in order and we do struct node star node then what we do is that if node is not null so we pass so in order and then we do for the node left child so in order node left then we do print the node data and then we do in order node right so this is the small code that we write and let's see how it works okay so let's see so i have some data let's say 40 60 30 10 35 70 and 50 so this is my binary search tree and now i'm doing the in order tree traversal so i call in order with root i come here and then what happens so if node is not null so i do in order node left i come here so again if node is not null i do in order node left i come to node 10 now if i do no in order node left so this is null so i print node data 10 then I do in order node right which is null so I go back to the node 30 and then here again I print node 30 then I go back to node right and here what I do in order node left is null so I print 35 this is null I go back 30 I come back to 40 and I see that okay I print the 40 go to its right child 60 then it we do the recursion in order node left we come to node 50 this is null i print 50 this is null i go back to 60 print 60 i go to node right 70 this is null so i print 70 this is null i go back to 60 i go back to 40 and i'm done so this is about in order traversal using recursion so it was a kind of recap of how in order traversal happens and now we will see how to do it using without recursion our uh, iterative method i have to we have to do so let's see what to do now so while rubbing let's start thinking now also okay so i'm the interviewer so i'm the interviewing person and now is cleaning the board and by that time I'm thinking something so yes did you get any idea and I say yes I have got a few ideas and what is that 
so i say that okay whenever you are to use recursion it's kind of calling stack so we will use stack data structure and let's see what happens so now i have to print iteratively so i push a 40 there so i see that it is not what is getting printed first so what we need to do is i push 40 but i see that node left is not null so i can try out 30 so i try out 30 again i see that okay it's node is left is not null so i push 10 but now i see what that this node is left is null and now i come back here so till here it was same as the in order traversal so now i will let's say i pop out 10 and i say i've printed it so till here i'm fine but now what happens node right is null so i don't need to push so i directly come here so 30 so i think it is getting printed so i will pop it out i see that is also getting fine but next i find it is 35 so it means now i'm not going directly to the stack again and popping the element out but what i'm doing i'm pushing something and what i'm pushing node right of 30 so i push 35 here and then what happens i see that okay node 35 is on the top i pop it out its node left is null and then i try to push its right element but that is null so now i come and process node 40 i pop it out i print it so here till here it's matching now i push its right child so 60 comes here and then what i will keep pushing till what i did in node 40 as root so i keep pushing so it's node left which is 50 and then what happens i find that okay now it's node left is null so i pop 50 out and i try to push because i have to see the right child also but it is null so i don't do anything i come back to 60 i push that thing out because in in order that's what you have to do you have to process the left subtree then the node and then the right so i pop out 60 but i push the right child which is 70 so i go to 70 now i see again so what i start doing by keep pushing its left child but it has none so i pop out 70 and try to push its right child which is null so 70 is also done and now my stack itself becomes empty and i see that okay this is the in order traversal so i have got the basic idea what i was using one data structure was stack and another thing was i was pushing elements to the stack till node left was not null when it was null so i popped out the element and then pushed it right child and then this was done repeatedly so that what happens and now let's see the code so this is the code and let's see what we are doing we will analyze so in order iterative we pass the root of the binary tree here i have a stack of binary tree s and binary tree star current is equal to root i have a boolean done is false which is basically seeing that okay is am i done so while not done so what i do if current is not null so i push the current element onto the stack and then i do current is equal to current left that's what we were doing i was pushing current is equal to current left till current became null so this part is done now what happens else what happens if current was null so when we found out if here it is null here it is null so what we did now so if the stack is empty like it happened in the end then we are done otherwise what if the stack is not empty so we will have current is equal to top so we pop the element out and pushed it current is equal to current right so this one we now push it here so that's the idea of this code and we will try to see with one small example okay so let's have a small example 40 20 60 and let's say 50 
70 so let's say this is the tree so what happens now so let's start so I start so we pass the root pointer and let's have a stack here okay so what happens done is false current is equal to root if current is done is false so if current is null so no it is not null so I push 40 here so what happens now I push the 40 and current is equal to current left so now I go there I again come done is false still so current is not null now this is the current so I push current so it becomes 20 here and current is equal to current left this is null so next time I go if current so it is null so I come back is stack empty no so current is equal to s dot top so 20 I pop out 20 and it is printed here and current is equal to current right so which is again null so I go here so if current current is null so is stack empty no so we what we do current is equal to s dot top so it is 40 now and we pop out 40 print it and we make current is equal to current right so I come back here to 60 to 60 now I come and I push so if current is null so no and we do s dot push current so we push 60 here and then what happens current is equal to current left so we come to 50 and again is current null so no so we push 50 here and then what happens current is equal to current left so null so we come here stack is not empty so we do current is equal to s dot top here and we pop it out so it will be now 50 so we pop it out and current is equal to current right which is null so current is null so we come here stack is not empty so current is equal to s dot top so it becomes 60 we pop out 60 and then current is equal to current right so we come to 70 and then what happens current is not null so we push 70 here and current is equal to current left so it is null so what happens stack is not empty so we pop out that 70 and current is equal to s dot top and current is equal to current right so now it is null and stack so it is null so we come here if stack empty yes so we are done done is equal to true so next time we don't go into the for loop and we see we have in order traversal as it is in the ascending order for the binary search tree so this was about in order traversal using iterative method i hope you understand it and if you like this video please subscribe to my youtube channel and share this video among your friends thanks a lot